Hey there, Carrie Clark here with Speech and Language Kids and SLP Solution. And today I'm gonna to show you how I use BoardMaker to create my therapy materials. So as you may have heard this week, we are announcing our partnership with BoardMaker. They are allowing us to use their picture communication symbols in all of our products. So there's a nice, super clean look where there's a consistent uh, use of pictures throughout. So all of our materials are gonna have that same look, those same symbols, which helps children get familiar with them. So I love using the BoardMaker platform and I had reached out to BoardMaker specifically to ask if we could use their symbols. So they are now a partner with us and in exchange for uh, allowing us to use their symbols, then we are showing you guys what we're doing with them. So today I'm gonna show you the BoardMaker platform. So this is the software I have on my computer. And I'm just going to show you real quick how I would put together a therapy a thing, something for therapy. So I like to use this button, button, the button button, uh, and just kind of drag a shape, however big I want it. And then I click this spray and I can expand that out to however many boxes I want. Now I use this a lot when I'm making uh, maybe a therapy activity for articulation for speech. Like if I'm having them say certain words and I want a whole page of those words, or I can cut them out and make them flashcards, or this is also really good for a simple AAC board where you have them point. There's lots and lots of different things you can do with BoardMaker, um, but this is one that I tend to use a lot, so this is what I'm gonna show you today. Once you get your squares where you want them, then you come over here to the symbol library, and you can scroll down and open up a folder. Let's say you are looking for um, grocery shopping. Maybe you're going to give them a simple AAC board for things they could get at the grocery store. So you can just scroll through and look at the words that they have and see which ones you want to add on. So maybe I want to have eggs. So I just drag it over into one of those boxes and it automatically sizes to the right thing. Uh, let's see, maybe we need some, whoops, where did it go? Frozen food. So we grab that going slow because I have the video recording on too. I am maximizing my processing. So you just add them onto the lines. Okay, let's say you wanted to use a simple AAC board or teach some core vocabulary for a functional communication user. Uh, so we could say, let's see, we're going to search for help. And you can see all the different kinds of help available on here. They have the ASL signs for help. They have pictures that look like real people. They have more symbol-y kind of ones or um, picture ones. So there's lots of different options. And the other thing that I love about this is that they have included children of different races as well. So you can see that there's different uh, choices that you can pick based on the population that you're working with. So I love that. Let's see, how about stop? We'll get stop because that's a great one for beginning communicators. So you can see we are adding our words and we just plop them in. And then once we're done, we create a PDF of this and we can print it out. Um, you can also do things where you actually um, like push them on BoardMaker, but I tend to just print mine out because that's what I need. Let's see. Oh, the other thing you could do is if you are looking for, let's say, speech words, you could just type in words that start with a certain sound or contain a different certain sound. So you can have pop, we have pop here. So let's say we're doing P words. We can do pet, pet on there. Oops, I didn't grab it. We can do pink. You can see I'm really kind of blowing through this. I can put a lot of words on here pretty quickly and uh, then have a very neat looking page that I can either use in therapy or send home as homework. Um, so lots of lots of great options in this board maker program. All right, I'm going to stop for there because I don't want this to be too long of a video, but I wanted you to get a feel for what you can do with board maker uh, so that you kind of have an idea and uh, to once again, thank board maker for their partnership with us for letting us use their wonderful picture communication symbols. Um, and Toby Dynabox, of course, as well. They are the the part the parent company of BoardMaker. So you can check this out at GoBoardMaker.com and let me know if you have any questions about BoardMaker. I'd be happy to answer them. Thanks so much.